try to always examine that, even even when we're going through you know a season where it is going smoothly or we are winning consistently. Um, so you're always trying to you know get better at what you do or how you do things. Um, you know, I I still am not ready to abandon you know core things that we believe in as a group and as a team and you know especially the makeup of our team and um what we expect to be um so there is a level of uh reinforcing and continuing to you know go all in on what we believe in but but there's all also you know tough con conversations along the way where can we make improvements where can we plug things up um, so those are things that, you know, we're always trying to do and I'm always trying to do. And, and when you as a manager, Aaron, when you try to take the temperature of these guys or, or where, you, where they're at, uh -huh. what, what do you see when you have your communication with them or, or talking about the struggles that you guys are going through or, or how, they're, how they're feeling kind of as a group with the, the team frustration that it must be right now? Um, I, th I actually think as a group they're, they're doing okay. You know, um, I do believe – that they are really confident in what they they can and hopefully will do and i think that confidence is born out of for good reason Th these guys know what they're capable of doing we've certainly done it in spurts this year um again it's been it's been up and down um you know we've gotten a little bit healthier from a position player standpoint and getting some guys back and i don't want to lose sight of the fact that you know, from especially from an offensive standpoint, we're a different team than we were three weeks ago. We're a better group. We still haven't gotten to where we want to get to, um, and there's there's a lot of meat on that bone to continue to improve and get better and get to be that juggernaut we expect to be. Um, but I think the guys, even though there's been you know days or series where there's been some frustration and. You know, you get a little bit down. I, I do believe at their core, they're very confident in, in themselves and each other. Thanks, Aaron. Peter Body, you have the next question. You got to unmute, Pete. You got me? Yep. Okay, sorry. Uh, Aaron, how often do you, uh, do you go through PFPs and that kind of fundamental stuff during the season? And, uh, you know, was it was there just kind of a little too much uh, sloppiness uh, this weekend in Boston? No, we, we do it most just about every homestand. Um, okay. We've done it the last probably three or four homestands where, uh, you know, it's it's something that we try to do. OK. And do you feel like there's been, you know, kind of stretches of sloppiness through the court, you know, the, this first half of the season? Yeah, I mean, I, I feel like, you know, I think sometimes when we think of sloppiness, um, you, you know, you think defensive side, understandably, or, or base running. Um, you know, <clears throat> I feel like a, a large portion of the season, and, and I think one of the things that actually fueled our turnaround in the month of, of May when we really started playing better weren't really um, hitting a lot or, or weren't doing offensively what we thought. But what, one of the things that fueled the turnaround, along with our pitching, I, I felt like was our defense and where we were, had tightened things up quite a bit. 